And here we have the two teams coming out now for this uh, friendly at the GST Gasa Stadium at the LAN, Tamworth versus Solihull Horse. Uh, filming today you've got Jay Price and Joe Adams on commentary and Harry Hanslow will be filming. Uh, going through the two teams now, starting off with Tamworth. In goal number one, Dan Jezef. Two, Andy Burns. Three, Stephen Morley. Four, Ellis Deeney. Five, Luke Jones. Six, Jack Lane. Seven, Sam Collison. Eight, Aman Verma. Nine, Bradley Reeves. Ten, Daryl Knight. And eleven, Connor Taylor. And now for the Solly Hall team, number one, Nathan Va Vaughton, number two, Carl and Jack Thomas, number four, Tom Tonks, number five, Paul Green, number six, Joel Kettle, number seven, Jack Edwards, eight, Darren Carter, nine, Luke Benbow, ten, Jermaine Hurton, and eleven, Alade Affalayan. Kick off here now, versus Tamworth versus Solihull Moors. Come on, Tamworth. Solihull just passing it around the back a bit, now putting out to their right winger. Ball goes out for a Tamworth throw. Solihull now advancing. Going to go into the middle of the park. Good pressure from Burns, but Solly all gets away with it and he's coming forward, playing it out to the right. Looking to get ball in the box here. Solly Hall Moores takes it in the middle, takes a strike away, but it's easy for Dan Jizzle. First sh shot on goal. First shot on target for either team. Comes through. Dan Jezzle, comfortable save. They're looking to attack Dan's right hand side. Moore looking to hold him up, but he manages to get the ball in. Oh, fumbled there from Jezef, but good good recovery save and the clearance there from Jack Lyon. Oh, Solly Hall looking for the run now down that right hand side, but two players weren't caught on the same wavelength and Jack Lane's able to clear it. Oh, good pressure again there, there. Bradley Reed now through the middle. Bradley Reed, one on one with the keeper. Takes it round in, that's, that's got to be a pen. Pen to Tamworth. Solly Hall keeping that happy there. Here we go now, Bradley Reed stepping up for Tamworth, looking to make it 1-0, right footed into the top right, great pen there, 1-0 Tamworth. Looking to play one out to the left, Daryl Knight for Tamworth. Looking to, get in, looking to get inside, puts the ball in, oh, but not quite there again. But it comes back out to him, Daryl Knight with another chance to cross. Gets it in, Andy Burns at the back post, oh, just a bit too high for him. But it was a good idea, Andy Burns now advancing down that right-hand side. It's good pressure though from Tamworth, they're not allowing Solly or any chance to go forward, although Paul Green now looks over the top. But that should run through. Dan Jezef has actually given away a penalty there. That's unfortunate for the Tamworth keeper, but it did look like a penalty. Here we go then, Solly Hull are going to try and equalise on on the 45th minute. There right, we go, penalty now, it's, it's in. Nice and calm penalty there from the Solly Hull striker. And that's 1-1. One, one. <laughs> Balls into Bradley Reed, holds it up well, finds Connor Taylor who was tackled, but Verma picking it up. Inside to Dini. Now Daryl Knight looked to just put it into that far corner, but it was just wide and goal kick to Sally Hill. Corners whipped in there. It's headed away though by Luke Jones, I think. Callum Powell now. Skins his man now. Tamworth on the counter maybe. Callum Powell driving forward. Still going is Callum Powell. Oh, the pass work didn't quite have enough power on it to find Dean Rathbone. And now Verma looking to switch to play for Matt Curley, but it's not going to reach him, and the Solihull keeper clears it. 
And there we go. Full time at the um, at the Lamb here. Final score: Solihull one, Tamworth one. Um, the next game here will be on Friday, the 28th of July, where Tamworth will face an Aston Villa 11. Highlights of that game will also be up the same weekend, the 29th or the 30th of July.